Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and we're going to be taking a look at a new game called Occupy Mars. Survive and colonize Mars in a highly technical open world sandbox game. Build and upgrade your base, discover new regions, co conduct mining operations, retrieve water, generate oxygen, grow crops, and fix broken parts. This is coming out May 10th, which should be today. Um, I don't know how much it's going to be because I'm recording this on the 9th. And I just want to say thank you to the developers for sending me a free key. We're going to go ahead and start a new game here. And you could do campaign, free play, or tutorial. I am going to start with a campaign. Are you sure you want to start a new game? Yes, I am. And here we are. Sitting in a chair, waiting for stuff to happen. There we go. An A12 suit AI. My suit talks to me like Spider-Man's iron... What was it was it called Iron Spider Suit? Calibration in progress. Confirm the visibility yeah. of the parameters on the helmet display. It's gonna explain you every it's gonna explain to you everything that's on the HUD. I already went through all this and I don't want to go through it again. If you really want to read all this, just go ahead and pause it in between each, you know, thing. It's pretty self explanatory. I mean kind of wish I could skip through this. But then again, like what'll happen is I'll i I'll like I'll be playing the game and then I'll be like, Well, how do I do this? And I'll be like, Well, it was in the tutorial, you skip through it because I'm an impatient SOB. So you got O2 for the suit, exterior O2, altitude, a lot of good information here. Health, stamina, hunger, hydration. There you go. Come on. All right. And over here is your ailments if something's wrong with you. Over here is the um, weather um, outside, you know, is it, do we have tornadoes or is there a fire, fire somewhere? Um, the fire thing's probably heat. Okay. Text messages. And that's if your, uh, your suit needs power. So that's like the power on your suit. And now that thing right there is like, shows you where your missions are. All right. Sounds good. Now they're going to, they're going to. <laughs> they're gonna insist that I do two mi two of the tutorial missions every time I play the game, even though I've already done them. So, but you guys haven't seen them, so we'll go through basic movement. I mean, this is like some basic, basic stuff. You know, WASD, like really. Right, so we're gonna run through here, and then we're gonna run through here. I'm gonna use my flashlight. Then we're gonna run through here. It's gonna it's gonna show me how to duck. Yeah, it's telling me how to sprint. Yeah, I'm sprinting. And then it's gonna want me to duck, which is C for some reason. I guess C is crouch, but yeah. I mean, everyone knows C is supposed to be control. Or uh, duck is supposed to be control. Then we got to jump with the space bar. Pretty obvious stuff right there. Open and the come to the tablet. Oh, yeah, we got to open up our tablet. The version of the tablet presented during the Got training. it. Inventory. In the inventory, you will find it. Yep. God, I'm going to go through all these messages or, you know, that tech tree. You know, you can open up tech stuff. I don't want to cut all this out, but I don't, I don't want to, like to be too long either. In the blueprints tab. Yep. Some are too complicated. Knowledge. I'm a smart guy. Yep. Got it. Robots. I want some robots, please. And radar, or in other words, the map. Got it. All right, cool. And that should be it, right? Yeah. There we go. Press V to change camera view. So that's good. And let's get the heck out of here and do the second one. Um, took me two minutes at the, I like the way he tells you how long it takes, you know, you can kind of try and see how fast you can do it. All right. And then the next one's going to be building a construction. So this is a, a little more interesting. This isn't just move around with WSD and jump with the Welcome space bar. ERA simulation training. This one's going to want me to pick stuff up so you can grind stuff down. So there's this little grinder right here. So we're going to pick up the this grinder and then we're going to scrap this stuff. There we go. And does that automatically go in my inventory, huh? Yep. There is. That's a scrap. Oh, pack of screws. Is that what I got? Hmm. I'm not sure what I got. That's interesting. Oh, yeah. Improved uh, grinder. One pack of screws. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Okay. So, I'm getting plates. All right. So, I got um, five, six plates. Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, cool. Very good. So, let's come over here. Now, now in order to build, you need, like, a blowtorch or something. So, we're going to grab this torch. And then we are going to select airlocks. Okay, tab, blueprints, airlocks. That's not an airlock, but okay. And there we go. And now to build it, you just take out your torch. And you get close enough, and there you go, all built. Beautiful. Right mouse button puts your tools away. And then over here, approach the bottle, press E, and then you could kind of like throw this on the ground if you want. Right click, throw stuff on the ground. If it's a tool, it puts it back in your inventory. If it's something else, it goes on the ground. So we're going to pick that up and we're going to drink it. There you go. And I think we are just about done here. 
All right. Tools are efficient. Uh, go towards the panel. There you go. All right. That wasn't so bad. Like freaking going through that light speed. Oh, 410. It was like double the other one. All right. So we got a new message. This is being laggy a little bit. There we go. Um, confirm the message. All right. Use the elevator to go down to level zero. All right. Cool. We can get out of the thing. Hey, sucks to be you, lady. You stay here. Oh, oh, no, up one, please. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, how do I get out of this thing? What the hell? Oh, there it is. What's up, bro? You probably want to go down to the base. Yep, that's sounds... all you have to do is go this way. I have sent on your tablet the place where you should report. You should check in with the governor. Wait a minute. Uh, one more thing. HSE manager wants me to remind you that you can use your tablet to gain info about suit parameters and peripherals. You can manage them here, change water and oxygen bottles, unfasten the helmet, and do other stuff. You do everything using the touch screen on your tablet. And remember not to leave the base without a helmet. You have the boss of me. If I want to leave the base without a helmet, I'll do it. Who do you think you are, bruh? Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, oh, hells yeah. I just had to grab a screenshot. Freaking. Dope. All right, come through here. Um, go down here. Hmm. I didn't. I don't think I went down last time. Maybe I did. Come on, open the door. I don't have all day. What's going on? Why is it still making noise? Why can't I get out of here? There we go. Give me a. Let me out, bro. Damn you, stupid double doors. Oh, finally. Here we are. Maybe I did go down in my test game. I did a test game for like a half hour to get used to the game. I guess I did go down because... Honestly, if you didn't go down, you probably wouldn't... Oh, that was... Right out of a ship. Cool. Very cool. Alright. Now that we came in here, we can take off our suit helmet, but I will let them tell me about it first. Engineer, right? Welcome to the Alpha Base. I'm the governor of this wonder of human ambition and your boss for the entire turn. If you want to know more, spare me the questions and look at your tablet after the interview. You have a long flight behind you, so today we will exceptionally give you a break from work. Let the doctor take a look at your parameters and then go rest in your room. That's all. Why don't you look at your parameters, dick? What's up, doc? Dr. Hannah Lan, Alpha Base Crew Medical Supervisor. In accordance with arrival procedures, I need to take a reading and evaluate your medical condition. So far, my my thought process on the AI is the the um the AI looks kind of weird. Their lips aren't moving in the you know early access. But so far, the voice acting is actually really good. Usually in these early access games, the voice acting is horrendous. This is solid. Data reading from your tablet. The suit sends the metrics of all the vital parameters to it. I see that for the moment, everything is fine, except that you should rest. Even a decent chair is not as comfortable as a bed. Whenever you want to fully recover, use the bed in your habitat and take off your helmet when you're in rooms full of oxygen. Try to the technical department was supposed to update the valve control of the suits so that oxygen would be taken automatically without having to remove the helmet. However, there were sometimes unpleasant malfunctions, and headquarters put this on hold until further notice. Okay. So be sure. Take off your helmet. All right, got okay, it. Okay, you can go. Look in my office when you get some sleep. I'll check your can parameters again. Can I just open again. that with eye? Yes, I can. I won't remember, but... There we go. Take off that helmet. Okay. All right, so are we supposed to go this way or? No, I think we're supposed to go this way. Oh, the lights only come on when you're walking by them. That's cool. That's efficient. No, this is right. This is where I came in. Uh, nope. Right here. I never know when I'm going to be going outside. <laughs> All right, so it wants me to lay down in the bed, drink some water. Okay. Um, where's the bed? I must have went to the wrong spot. Of course I did. Come on, open up. It's a lot of stuff on my desk, and oh, I don't remember it giving me the option last time. There's a lot of stuff on my desk, and I'm not sure if I should take any of it with me. I'm going to leave it all there. 
Um, when I get up, I'll show it to you. Oh, nice and rested. All right, let's skip this. All right. Uh, can I lag in here? What's going on? There we go. Game saved. Okay, so that was an auto save. Fair enough. So you see there's a lot of stuff on here. Laptops and all kinds of stuff. We'll leave it alone for now. Um, I don't really know what it would do for me. So go to the bathroom and we're going to drink some water. So you have water in your suit, I believe. Yeah, right there. No, H2O is right there. I don't know why they're having me drink out of a sink. It looks like it's full. So, but I'll, I'll do it anyway. Okay, use the toilet. And now we got to take the poop out. Take out the poop. And we need to bring it to the hydroponics place. So let's go do that. See, I'm always nervous right here that like, it's gonna be opening up to the outside. But I guess I'll just keep going this way because it's the direction it's telling me to go. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is a nice hydro hydroponics place, look at this. Fancy schmancy. Okay, so there's my poop. And there you go. Soil, fertilizer, resources ready to process. Um, am I supposed to hit recycle or is it going to tell me to do that? Yeah, it, it does want me to. All right, there you go. So we got five poop and no soil, I guess. Or no res resources in stock. Okay. Get out of there. Harvest the tomato and harvest corn. Tomato and corn. Talk to the governor, talk to the doctor. All right, let's do this. Coming through. Governor and the doctor. Oh my God, it's so slow walking through here with these doors, all these closed. All right. This is the, the doctor's place or the governor? Oh, it's the governor, okay. I hope that the rest was good. There will be no opportunity to laze around for the next few days. Your predecessor has left you with a ton of work. Uh, I'm glad more than five months of uh, a flight has already worn me out. Why, five months? That's not bad. That's fine. As I said, there's plenty of work to do. I'll send you all the most urgent tasks to the tablet. After completing them, you will receive the next ones. I know you have a great desire to explore the base now, but combine it with work. We've been waiting for a specialist for too long. So I, I said, that's really good. It, how, how long did it take us to get to Mars right now? I think it's anywhere between six months and two years, depending on where it is in orbit. Is it six months? I know two years is the, is the upper part, but I don't know how, like if we, if we left at exactly the right time, what is the quickest way we can get to the quickest time we can get to Mars? It might actually be six months. As you wish, everything on this list is a priority. Don't waste too much time on nonsense and don't break your arm while fooling around like the previous one. Before you go to work, make sure you take a fuse with you. That's it for now. Oh, and one more thing. <sighs> Before I send you all the tasks, go to the sick bay. Hannah said she needs to do some more tests today. As soon as I get the green light from her, you start with the tasks. Okay, this guy's kind of a dick. Bossy mother effer. Warning, uh, expected... Significant temperature drop in one hour. Yeah, but that's outside. All right. So... Wait a minute. Is she all the way over here? Damn. She's far. I go through freaking crops and everything to get to her. All right, you. Give me the once over. You definitely look better. I won't examine you. It was just an excuse. I'm glad you're here because I wanted to talk to you about something. You probably already know about Martian bingo. I don't know what that is. This is sort of a local tradition. Fun, which was intended to improve the spirits of the colonists. Being in our specific conditions for a long time takes quite a toll on the psyche. Um, that's a weird way to spell fun. No, it is not a matter of special concern for the employee's health. The corporation is only safeguarding itself against declining productivity. I came up with... <sighs> so I came up with this game to make people feel better and to disperse... Okay, come on. The game integrated newcomers as well as those staying at the station longer. 
by the way, it helped to implement all the procedures and familiarize with the structures. It consisted of performing very simple tasks. However, over time, Martian bingo began to get out of my control. Okay, get to the point. Well, it's like talking to my wife. Unsafe. Participants quickly got bored and began to make up new tasks that balanced on the edge of common sense and sometimes went completely off the rail. I am responsible for this, so I wanted to warn you before you get involved in something stupid. Okay. I don't know exactly. I can only see the physical effects of these games, and I'm not always able to fix the effects. <sighs> I'm afraid they've come up with something stupid again. Several, right, several ampules of powerful antidepressants, along with drugs to mitigate the yeah, effect. Yeah, okay, I can help you find you. them. Unfortunately, yeah, okay. Wait, come back okay. if you need my help. Sheesh. And please, don't do anything do stupid. Do your job. Find a faulty fuse and replace it with a new one. Fix, uh, and fix, and after that, turn on CO2 uh, scrubbers. Okay. Uh, are these popping up? Yep, over there. Okay, how do I get over there without going outside? Okay. Maybe I do have to go outside for this, actually. Where do I get more oxygen? Yeah, I'm not really sure where to get more oxygen, so I'm not sure if they want me to, Maybe they don't want me to go outside yet. Oh, darn it, it's you. I love that the mission is, quote, unquote, do your job. That's freaking funny. Um, oh, what, what is this? Can I take some stuff here? Can I grab some stuff? Uh, well, I can grab a helmet, but I don't need one. Oh, oh oxygen model. Picked up oxygen model, but I, did I fix my O2? I think I did. No, O2 still there. Oh, okay, cool. So just throw this out. Eh, the hell with it. <laughs> the hell with it. All right, cool. Um, oh, wait. I passed whatever I was looking for. Oh, okay. This game's nothing like what I remember when I played it two years ago. Uh, wait, what? Alrighty, so I had a fuse in my inventory, and all I had to do was put the fuse on my hotbar, and then I came down here and I just clicked around until it freaking worked. So, that's good. Alright, so now I gotta fix the O2 canister. Or the, I'm oh, sorry, the CO2 scrubber. I guess I could just take some of these with me. Right? Can I just put that in my inventory? Hold on. Uh, I think, I think it's in my. I had it in my inventory before. How did I get it in my inventory? No, it's just falling on the ground. Maybe you can't. I guess you can't take it with you. I thought I saw it in my inventory, but maybe it was in my inventory. It was it when it was in my hands? So let's take this scrubber. Right. And now what? Temperature. Fill oxygen bottle. Fill. Um, fix. And after that, turn on the O2 scrubber. What's wrong with it? Temperature? Temperature's too high? I don't know. Is there anything else I can mess around? Oh, hold on. Did that fix it? 100. Oh, so the temperature's going down. So that's good. How do I get it down even more? All right. There we go. Start flipping switches until stuff works. Press fill bottle on the screen. Press fill bottle on the screen. Okay. Um, what? Hold on. Let me see what that's all about. Oh, can you just still don't have today's auction on the tablet? I send you a cord and scrubber to use it. Oh, okay. I think I know how to do that. Maybe. Um, I gotta find those oxygen bottles, right? That I passed before and then fill it up. I don't remember where they are, though. I don't even know if that's, how, if, if that's what I have to do. I take it back. I think I have to fill my suit from this thing. 
Fill oxygen bottle. There we go. Uh, remove. Okay, I don't know what that means, but that's fine. Um, take the bottle filled with oxygen. Uh, corn, take the bottle. Take a bottle filled with oxygen. Um, equipped the filled bottle. Equipped. Equipped. I think it's showing me how to do what I've already done. Oh, how do I equip it? There we go. O2. Did I do that? There we go. Process the harvested vegetable in vegetables into food. Okay. Is there a place I have to do that? Not seeing anything. Um, oh, this way. Okay, come on. Oh, here we go. How's everybody doing? How's it going, everybody? Why does my suit O2 still say it's so low? Yeah, my oxygen bot is full. But look at my suit O2. Or is that the person I'm looking at suit? No, that's mine, I think. All right, whatever. Um, come over here. And food process. Do I do them both at the same time? Packages. Nutrition, 8.6. Yeah, I can do them both at the same time. Well, three of them. Oh, wait, what? Uh... Burnt fuse, yeah, that's the the burnt fuse is the fuse I took out of the um the one I had to replace. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here. Is that the um tomato? That's corn. Maybe I do have to do one at a time. I don't know. Take the food from unit compartment. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so there was stuff in the compartment. That's why I couldn't. That's why I couldn't do anything. I'm gonna do some more of this. Oh. Is there more stuff in the compartment? Oh, maybe you have to close the compartment? Yeah, this all makes sense. It's not something you normally have to do in a game. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty specific, but it does make sense. There we go. Yeah, let's get some more food out of there. And close the thing. Eat a package of food, but I'm not even hungry. Um, yeah, okay. Why is there an exclamation point there? Is, is that because it's like superfood? Uh, consume. Okay. Take the board. Uh, the board. Okay. So if you look on the bottom middle, that's a compass, and that'll show you the direction. It's a, it's a much easier way to see the direction you got to go before you actually see the marker on your HUD. Come on. What? Sleep deprivation. Warning. Get some rest. Oh. Crap. I don't know. Is there a map? Oh, there is a map. Beautiful. Where is it? Does it show where my sleep thing is? Um, airlock, iris. It's not showing me where I sleep, but it's got to be up this way. Past here. It's, those look like sleeping compartments. The only place I could find the sleep was you got to come up here and like, I think this one right here. I couldn't get into any, any of the other ones, I guess, because that's like my personal sleep area. So... All right, let's see if we can find this board, whatever that's for. By the way, the game won't let you walk out into the, you know, onto Mars by mistake, so you don't have to worry about that. The place, the thing just won't open. All right, and I got the board. Take this body board into your hands and insert it into the robot's body. Um, okay. Oh, robot's not here. Why is the board not with the robot? Come on, guys. You didn't think, you didn't think this one out. I find that stupid robot. Stupid robot. All right. We're getting there. Okay, see, so you can't go that way. That, I believe, will go out into, uh, not into space, but out where I can't breathe. All right. And watch out. I got to get the robot. Good. Uh, is the robot through here? Oh, they got a little place to watch TV. That's nice. Breaking news. Just moments ago, another colonization rotation of ERA company has successfully landed on Mars. The arriving employees are now heading to their quarters to rest after a long journey. Hey, that's me. The They're talking about me. Come on. Really? 
that's the way I have to go. Where am I? Uh, okay. Not really sure. Um, I'll try and go this way, I guess. I don't know. Trying to get out of this freaking maze. I'm not really sure why this is locked, so I'm just gonna go ahead and unlock it. Oh, it won't even let me. Okay. So right here is the door, but it kind of goes right into another area. So I'm not really sure how to get around here, but I need to go over here somewhere. So I'm going to see if I can make my way over there. Let's go ahead and put our helmet on. Um, my, my suit is completely out of power, which kind of sucks. I think I'm going to have some real issues here. Uh, apparently the robot is not inside. It's outside. So I have to go out and take care of it. I do have the board right here. So what you need to do is you need to come in these airlocks and you, you flip the switch on one. Come on. You gotta wait until it's closed. Uh, maybe, I, maybe my hand has to be empty. Yeah, why can't I flip that? There we go. Come on, flip it. And then you flip this one. And there we go. I guess you don't have to flip, you can just walk outside. Now I do have some serious radiation issues here, so I'm gonna have to do this as quickly as possible. Go ahead and fix them. Um, it's not doing anything. Uh, e. There we go. Now we talk to this idiot, and he's going to. I can't. Uh, hold on. I can't really sit here and talk to this guy for very long. Come on. Sure. There we go. If you get too close, you'll right, I gotta go inside. I can't. It's I can't mess around them. See, my health is dropping because of the radiation. It's great because it provides energy even at night. Right. Unfortunately, and this little thing there we go. A lot of radiation All right. So I have, am having health issues now. My uh, God, shut up, dude. I'm having health issues. So will food give me back health? I don't know. Um, doesn't seem like it. Well, I do have health packs in my base. Um, actually in my room, I opened up a bunch of containers and there are health packs in there. So I'm gonna have to use the health packs. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I can't get power back in my suit. If there's a way to get power back in my suit, I have no idea how to do it. So I'm just kind of stuck at this point, trying to, you know, do what I can do. Maybe the doctor will fix me up for free. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop by her. I'm gonna get my hit points back. And then we need to raise Spotty's arm. So we need to sit out there, half dying while we're trying to mess around with this dog because I can't get power back in my suit. There might be a power way to get power back in my suit, but I'm not sure What's how. Um, what's missing? Yeah, I don't care. She did, she's not gonna heal me. What a, what a piece of work. I'm in my room, and as you can see here, these are the uh, things that I opened. All right, and that's where I found the, the medical kits. The problem is I can only carry one medical kit because I have to carry it like this, which kind of sucks. The good news is my health comes back on its own and it comes back pretty fast. So that's good. I mean, I, I get it done. It's just gonna be a, it's just gonna be a little bit of a pain, and this place is really hard to find my way around. And it's just kind of feel like a rat in a maze. Uh, where'd my thing go? All right, whatever. I don't seem to be carrying it with me anymore. Um, okay, well, whatever. I'm sure we'll get it done. All right, here we go. We gotta raise the dog's arm. Okay, radiation. All right, so pick that up, and I guess we gotta place it on him. There we go. Uh, take the electronics. All right, we gotta keep an eye on our health here. I'm just gonna take all this stuff. There we go. I'm gonna get back in. I know my health's doing pretty good, but I'm gonna get back in just to let my health come back a little bit, make sure we're staying high. Um, there we go. And we will get our health back. It'll just take a little bit of little bit of time. Ah, weather forecast. Damn it. So the weather forecast was not wrong. Check out these dust devils, man. It's pretty cool too, because there's like there was windows in this place, right? I was um I was walking through and there was like glass and now the glass is covered up. Oh wait, no it's not. Darn it. Okay, I thought the glass would be covered up with the dust devils. Oh that's freaking dope. That looks really cool. I like that. It's weird though because it wouldn't let me sleep. It said you can't sleep when your life is in danger. I was like, it really shouldn't be in danger in here. I mean, I'm not outside, but yeah, that looks really cool. Now that the storms are all done, the next mission is to build a light. So just build a light pole in this area. Okay. And in order to build a light pole, I go to tech tree. Nope, not tech tree. I go to blueprints and there it is, light pole. 
All right, that's what all that stuff was on the ground for. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, wait, hold on. Hold your horses. I don't know if you, I don't even know if it matters if I put a helmet on. I mean, I don't know if I'm getting oxygen when my suit's not properly powered anyway, but couldn't hurt. Okay. Out here and out here. All right, blueprints, light. And I don't really know where I'm supposed to put it. So I guess I'll just put it right here. Sure. And now we just need to use the blue the the blowtorch. Uh, blowtorch. There it is. Number two. Two. There we go. All right. And there's your light pole, buddy. All right. Take the fire extinguisher. Wait, fire extinguisher? Oh, can I actually go back inside now? <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Give me that fire extinguisher. Put out the fire. Oh, there's a fire. Okay, well, this sounds like a sit-up-in-the-chair type of situation, guys. Why is there two fire extinguishers? One the fire and one's a fire extinguisher? Uh, yep. Why couldn't you do it? There's somebody, oh, there's somebody here. What else? Uh, remove the board from the device. Take it to the workshop in HQ. All right, where is that? Okay, it's over there. All right, let's get to the workshop in HQ. Cool, cool. Oh, that's up there. Okay, I'm going to save the game because um, I want to save the game. You know, sometimes you just got to save the game. You know what I'm saying? I get that feeling in my stomach. 99% of the time it's wrong, but the one time it's right. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, a cutscene. Look at me all working on stuff with my helmet and my reflection. I don't know why, but my cutscenes don't have any sound, so apologize about that. Where are they going? Are they going home? Oh, oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, no, keep going. No, don't come down. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. Well, good thing there is no sound because this would have been very loud. <laughs> I'd imagine this would have been very loud. Oh, boy. I've gained access to the build refrigerators. Where can I find them in the menu? Refrigerator, find the blueprint in the garage tab. I will not remember that. I'll probably be asking that question by episode three, and I won't remember. Man, that took a long time to freaking load. Holy crap. I was like wondering. It's not, I don't think it's a demo. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Where are the heck? What the? Um, run to the assembly point. Okay. Oh, that's right, I was upstairs. I can't see anything. Run to the assembly point. Oh, let's go this way. Um, we're gonna have to duck through this. And can we duck through that? Doesn't look like it. Sorry guys, I know you can't see anything. If it makes you feel any better, I'm seeing less than you. Um, okay, I guess I can... Wait, I can't... What the heck? I thought that was open. Uh, I'm not sure how to go. Do I gotta... No. Oh. <laughs> Bad physical condition. Okay, so... I don't think I'm gonna be able to play this... Play at this point. Um, player stats, main menu. You died by accident. Quick look. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to play, because I don't think... I don't think I... Since I don't have the, um, power for my suit... I, I... I can't see anything. And I don't think I can get through this place. Oh, this is... This is not good. Yeah, I think I'm done. I'm not really sure what the next part of the game is, guys, but I don't I don't see me being able to get to it. Oh, wait, hold on. I can't see anything. I guess there's only one way to go. Jump over that. Go through here, try not to get caught on fire. And I really can't see anything. 
Don't burn yourself, bro. Wait, do I have to duck through this? Yeah. Alright, hold on. I cannot see anything. Oh my god, I'm just running down a dark hallway. Jump. If I can't go, I just jump. 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 What? I don't think I can go any farther. Okay. I am not sure where to go. Oh, I d wait. How do I get... How do I get power? My suit should not have any power. Can't go into my inventory. Okay, well, whatever. At least now I can see. I'll try again since I can actually see. Go through here? I'm just going to keep going wherever I can go. Can't go through there. Nothing over here. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Come on, run. Okay, hold up. Hold up. Okay. I'll try again. Alright, so we can push this. So that's why we couldn't get through there. Alright, let's keep going. Keep going. Come on, I'm getting so close. Getting so close. The duck mechanic doesn't feel very, like, quick. Like, you go to duck and it doesn't duck quickly enough. Especially when you're trying to get out of this place. Alright. By the way, the, um, I did notice that the ship left without me. So, now what? Let's go this way. Come on. Come on. Get over there. I can't even see where I'm... Dude, you can't jump over this freaking railing? Seriously? Okay, I guess I'm not supposed to jump over the railing. Haul ass, bro. Haul ass. Uh, use that. Get in here. Can I... To close that, right? Alright, now open this. Um... Can't hear anything. How do I get in here? I don't see any, like, levers or anything. Um, system detected malfunctioning in the elevator is recommended to use the ladder. Okay. Well, where the hell is the ladder? It's gotta be outside, right? Oh, never mind. Uh, get to the emergency capsule. Dude, this freaking game is, like, so... Oh my goodness, okay. This game is so smooth, and now it's just intense AF. How do I close this? Okay, that's it. All right, good. Man, this game is just, you know, you're going along, going along. It's smooth sailing. And then all of a sudden, the S hits the fan. I can't see anything. I had battery in my suit, and I didn't know it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So is this thing going to take you back to Earth, or what? Let's go back to Earth. Okay. Mm, I'm going to go back to Earth in that thing? Apparently. So we have failed. Everything's gone. Everything blew up. Everyone's dead. Well, no, not everyone's dead. I'm not dead. And here we are. What's next? What's going to happen next? I have no clue. I mean, am I just going back to Earth? Is that it? <laughs> Do I have to be like free? Oh, oh no. What's this? Stuff's going on. Oh, I'm going back down on into Mars, or I'm not really sure what's going on. I I took off of Mars. I would think that's an EV, an EV, an ERV, yes, an ERV, an Earth return vehicle. But now I seem to be crashing back. I would think I'm crashing back down to Mars. Who knows? Maybe I'm crashing back down to Earth. I'm thinking this will be like a campaign, and then like you know you have to do the free build where you could just build on Mars, which would be my next episode. If that is the case, I'm not really sure what's going on. I also got to figure out why there's no sound during the cutscenes. Um, so I'll just skip it.
No, I'm back on Mars. Completed. Emergency power generator active. Emergency oxygen generator active. Comms down. Detected nearby. Underground ice. Abandoned buildings. Small vehicle. Alpha base status. Critical damage. Radiation alert. No information on survivors. Caution, this escape pod is designed only for short-term survival. Lockers contain basic building materials and food rations sufficient for a few days. Recommended construction of well for water and solar panel for spacesuit recharging. Emergency access to technologies beyond your experience level temporarily granted. Obtain necessary permissions and confirm through the Tech Tree tab ASAP. It is mandatory to read the FAQ. ERA is not liable for any injuries or death. Lawsuits won't be respected. Good luck. Well, that's up to the lawyers. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, you know, that was a pretty crazy episode. One, if you guys want to see more of this game, where I guess I'm like kind of in a free build at this point, um, I might do another episode, like a real episode one, because that was kind of like a, I don't know what that was. That was kind of like just a, here's the game. And, you know, it was pretty fun, though. Like I said, if you guys want to see more of this, let me know in the comments. Uh, make sure to like the video. Uh, if you're new here, uh, maybe subscribe. That'd be pretty cool. Um, that'd be awesome. I do do two videos a day, and I stream three days a week. So I hope to see you coming back. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Mm -hmm.